So three points, but plenty of food for thought, I think. Plenty of food for thought. Um, it was a good win. It's a good win. Um, but I think at 3-0, um, our ability to close the game down and, uh, and just win it by that scoreline uh, was poor. I um, thought we played a, what I would call kamikaze football. It was like a defence versus attack and then swapping it around. Uh, and it's something we've got to learn from. But um, it's two wins and a draw and a loss out of the first four. Um, the side was patched up in the second half as, as you know, as, as a very fragmented. Um, so we, we, we've, got to, we've got to celebrate the three points and take it. Um, but in the back of our minds, we've got to be learning and, and a bit better over the 90 minutes. Yeah, I mean, the, the three games so far, especially the two away games going forward, uh, we've not created that much tonight. Buckets and buckets of chances, three good goals, uh, but unfortunately we were uh, more sloppy at the other end as well. Yeah, it's getting that balance. Um, look, we've we played four games now, and I, I don't think we've 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 come anywhere near our potential of what we of what we can do. Um, as soon as we do click, um, and we get that balance right between going forward, creating. Uh, and being a, a galvanised unit, then um, we'll develop that more consistent nature that we, we probably had in, in the latter stages of, of, of the season last year. Um, but look, they're, they're a group of new players, been thrown together, um, they're working extremely hard, there's one or two playing through the pain barrier with, with, with knocks and bruises, and um, you know, we've got to give the players credit for, for getting the results they have at, the, at this stage. So... Door Athletic away on Saturday, another long trip, and they've won four two at Eastley tonight. So, yeah, look, it's it, it's a very open league. You've got to give respect to everybody that you play against. Um, be a very very tough tough game, um, but we need to go into it and learn from 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 our, our mistakes tonight, uh, and, and and improve on 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 certain facets of our game. If we do that, like I've said, we we we, we can be competitive with anybody in this league. It's just a consistency within the 90 minutes I'm looking for now and a consistency game to game. Whereas we've become a little bit erratic in games, um, playing excellent at one stage and, and poor in the other. I'd rather now settle into a, a rhythm where we, we're six and a half out of ten throughout the game and six and a half out of ten for game to game now. Because Saturday at Torquay we were very, very solid. Yeah, we looked very solid. Uh, I thought we finished the game strong. don't think anyone could, could really uh, say that we didn't deserve anything out of the game. Um, but look, it's it, it's been a positive start. I thought I looked on paper and I thought we had a really, really a tough start. The journeys we've had to make, um, and the players have really, really worked hard. Um, not just in in the games, but in training, the recovery. They've been professional, uh, and I just I just think there's more to this group of players uh, that need adding to. Uh, but there's more to this group of players to come. And uh, I've said prior, and I'll, I'll say now once again that I think we'll we'll develop as a group of players as the season progresses, and um, you know the, the learning curve, the physicality, the mentality um, will improve the more we get an understanding of each other and, and, and roles and responsibilities. Thank you very much. Thank you.